Good afternoon. Thank you for watching Channel 3. I'm David Carroll. And I'm Latrice Curry in for Cindy Sexton. Tonight, we're learning more about the victims of a fatal bus accident in Mexico. A McMinn County man died in that crash. Eight Americans are among the 12 killed after a bus flipped over during a trip to the Mayan ruins in Mexico. 20 others were injured, and our Kate Smith is here with more. Well, Bob Beavers, along with his wife and two daughters, were on vacation to see the Mayan ruins. The family was very active at St. Mary's Catholic Church in Athens. Tonight, their church community is asking for support. It was a holiday cruise that ended tragically for the Beaver family of Athens. Bob Beaver is among the dozen dead. Shocked, saddened, as most people would be when somebody goes away on a... Uh, family vacation like this and the unexpected happens. Jim Wogan with the Roman Catholic Diocese of Knoxville said St. Mary, where the family attended, is one of the 51 parishes and mission churches in the diocese. He said hearing the news saddened his heart. It, it came as a shock and um, an unfortunate surprise and uh, I think the parish is going through their process of grieving and the bishop uh, is asked for prayers uh, to, to help that process along. Another 18 were hurt when the tour bus visiting the Mayan ruins overturned. The driver was injured and detained by authorities. The driver is facing vehicular manslaughter charges. A state prosecutor says preliminary findings indicate excessive speed and the driver's negligence caused the crash. The bus was a part of a fleet transporting visitors from two Florida-based Royal Caribbean cruise ships. Over the past 10 years, more than a dozen cruise bus excursion accidents have occurred in Caribbean ports. Well, the exact cause of the crash is still under investigation. Barbara Beaver and the couple's adult daughters remain at a local hospital. And of course, we will be sure to keep you updated as we learn more. But for now, I'm live in the studio, Kate Smith, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Kate. In a statement, Royal Caribbean Cruise Lines confirms 27 guests from their ships, Celebrity Equinox, and Serenade of the Seas were involved in the crash. 